on my neck. The bracelet matches the set. My brother name is Tina Dollar. Stop all that back and forth over the net. My mama wish I would've went corporate. She wish I would've went exec. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. Cherie, who am on back? They only giving niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the Met. You know I gotta bring the set. You know I gotta bring the G block. You know I gotta bring the D block. Cause you know how sticky it get. Hey, hey. You know how sticky it get. Hey, you know how sticky it get. Hey, you know how sticky it get. Hey, she want me to play with that cat. Hey, she love how I'm making her wet. Hey, you know how sticky it get. Hey, hey, yo, Eric, bring them. Okay, this is today's fit. This lime green yellowish sweater. Uh, it's a crop top, so you know I gotta put some underneath. And then these jeans that I got from Fashion Nova. And then my black Air Force. Yeah. And then this is what the makeup looks like. Came out really, really pretty. All right, I'm gonna talk to y'all in the car because we are what? Happy, happy Friday. It is Friday, you guys. Your girl tried to do a little something, something to get ready for work today. I did my makeup, so your girl's feeling cute. She's feeling fabulous on this gloomy day. But we are off to work. Your girl is excited. Oh my gosh, now he just ran around. No, no, he didn't. Yes, he did. But I'm so excited to just get this day over. Your girl is busy as hell, as always. Per usual, we're so busy. But anyway, I decided like I'm gonna try to vlog a little bit more at work. Today is gonna be like a spend the day with me work day. I don't know. We gon' we gon' finesse it, okay? And then I don't really have too much planned this weekend. Me and Aisha was talking about this new brunch spot that we want to go to. So we'll probably do that. And I kind of want to go kayaking, but if it's gonna be raining outside, the kayaking might have to. It might not happen, but I really been wanting to go kayaking. And then I want to get my nails done. I know in the last video or a few videos ago, I was talking about, you know, the only thing I could do is press ons because everybody need their hair done, but I want my nails done. So we'll see. I did find this guy on Instagram who does like all the cute stylish nails. He said he charged $150 for like the extra, extra long nails. So we'll see if I feel like spending $150. But the design and shit is so cute. So we'll see, girl. But anyway, I just kind of wanted to start this video off. And I will see you guys when we get inside the building. Call in regards to your claim number 5-59. Please give me a call at 602-866. So y'all know I'm just a complainer and I just literally can't help myself. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but y'all i was trying to like work with y'all but our phone systems have been down for like the last two days like people can call us but we can't make outbound calls so i can't call on any of the claims that i need to make a call to i was using my personal cell phone and i'm like i'm just calling them and just telling them to give me a call back but it's like it's still a hassle and i feel like i shouldn't have to do that so I'm low-key annoyed and then one of my co-workers is sick so one of my co-workers is sick this person supposedly has 53 voicemails and I don't understand how this person could possibly have 53 voicemails because we started around the same time we have about the same amount of claims and I don't come into 53 voicemails so how is this person coming into 53 like I'm 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 confused. Like the most voicemails I come into is eight. So how did this person have fifty-three voicemails? And you want me to check fifty-three voicemails? So I don't know if that's the truth or not, but I'm on my fifteen minute break and I'm about to go get me an energy drink and make and maybe some breakfast because I'm just I'm in a pissy ass mood and I'm trying not to be pissy. I'm trying not to, but one of the ladies just called me and she just irritated my soul as well. I did a claim with you a week ago and nobody has called me to follow up. 
and I sent her a link to send over her photo so we can write an estimate. I was like, have you submitted the photo so we can write an estimate? She was like, yes. I was like, well, I'm not showing that you submitted the photos so we can write the estimate. And then I was like, and I also don't have the shop that you want to use for your repairs. Have you decided on the shop yet? And she was like, no one told me I needed to pick a shop. And I'm like, on my notes, according to whoever took your statement, discussed that the shops that were in our network were too far. You said you didn't want to use our shops. She was like, yeah, it's true. Well, bitch, then if, if you don't want to use ours, then common sense says you have to pick your own. I mean, maybe it's me. But you have two options. You either pick your own shop or you use ours. And if you're not using ours, then what is the next option? You gonna go out and do it yourself? I'm not, I don't got time. Let me just go ahead and give me some breakfast. Maybe I'm hungry. Maybe I need an energy drink because you know, that's just my vibe. And maybe a girl will be in better spirits because this ain't it. <laughs> this ain't it! nice and early I'm a mess like I am genuinely a mess I'm a mess I know I know I know okay y'all these shorts right here are so freaking cute and then I low key like this dress Walmart is definitely stepping it up, but I feel like because it's at Walmart, I like this shirt as well. I kind of like these little plaided shorts or sports, but I feel like it's too childish. And I like that shirt. But I feel like... <gasps> okay, y'all, so I be liking to be cheap for stuff that don't require me to be cheap. But I feel like Walmart, like they should have shorts that cost $20. I mean, the shirts is cute. But I don't feel like they should be the, I don't feel like they should have been $20. I want to spend $10 from Walmart. But they were cute, so I got them. Hopefully they fit because, whew. yeah. But I did get them. All right, so. I'll do a little clothing haul with y'all when we get home. Well, I have to show y'all what I got as far as the clothes is concerned. But I got me a little breakfast bowl and my energy drink. So we about to crack this open and hope for the best. I low key thought about taking like a lunch right now, but I'm not. Okay, y'all. So this is the short that I got from Walmart. So these black leather shorts which fit cute i like them i guess and then i also got it in the color brown and then this shirt i would not obviously wear this shirt with these pants but i feel like i just wanted to try it on i like the way it's so fitting like the material on this feels so nice and i like how it has that triangle like that style of like the cut that is so cute she is giving body, period. Okay, this is the second dress that I got. And I mean, maybe if I had one with a medium, I would have liked it better. But right now, I feel like she's giving teacher. Like, I mean, it could be a cute dress that I can actually know. I can wear it to work. But this right here is giving sex. So I guess not. And then yeah i'm not feeling this one so i'm gonna take this back but that is the second one and this one was twenty dollars so yeah i mean it's okay but it's not the vibe i was going for so we're just gonna go ahead and return this baby Ooh, i need a one day <laughs> I'm about to make this. It is a beef 
lo mein stir fry that is about to be the dinner i just took a shot well we took a shot and then we went to walmart because i'm about to help aisha detox her locks because we haven't detoxed it and i keep coming across videos on how to detox it and i keep saying i want to detox her locks so we're about to do that and attempt to do that and she bought this big ass bucket not the beef stuff inside y'all i took that stuff back to walmart because i did just it just wasn't giving what it was supposed to have gave so we went ahead and returned all the items back to walmart because it's just not giving it's not giving y'all that noodle shit that shit is disgusting. I bought this chicken stir fry one. I low key just want to throw it in the trash. That is so nasty. And I like got a little buzz. I don't care how intoxicated I am. That is not it. No ma'am. Aisha is going to suffer through and eat that because she don't like pierogies because she don't like mashed potatoes. But me on the other hand, I love me a good pierogi. And this one is a loaded baked potato. So I'm excited to eat these. I've been wanting to eat these since I bought it. And I keep forgetting about it. And I came across it again when I was looking. And I'm about to make this. So I already know this about to taste good. My mouth is like already like watering for it. And I'm about to make me a cake. Or well, I'm about to make us a cake. I'm about to take my hair down. Do Aisha's here and call it a night. So I'ma see y'all tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. It is Saturday and this is today's outfit. Aisha kind of talking about my shoes because she said it don't really go, but then it goes. So I don't know which one it do, but this is the outfit. Y'all, I feel so freaking good right now. Like, I just took a shot and, like, a half or a double shot. I took a double shot and, like, a half, and I feel so good right now. Like, I feel so freaking good. But anyway, me and Aisha are on our way to this place called Bruzy or Boozy Brunch, and I'm so excited to try this spot out. I really want these French toasts that they have, but they have ice cream on it, so I'm not a fan of ice cream on my food. So I might try to French toast and just tell them to not put the ice cream on it and just give me like whipped cream or something. But I low-key want these French toasts and there's something else that I saw that I really like. But yeah, we're off to brunch. And then right after brunch, I want to go to this nail shop because I've been talking about getting my nails done. And a part of me wants to get my nails done, but the other part of me want to save $150 and just do it myself. Because y'all know I have everything at home where I can do it myself. I'm just not talented enough to like have the design. But I kind of want to just spend the time and just like do it because I told y'all like my time is spent doing Aisha's hair, my son's hair, and my hair. So I'm gonna spend $150 for somebody else to do my nails and then I'm gonna have to take it off. So I'm not a fan of that. So I low key just wanna like go to this nail shop that's out in Phoenix. Well, we're in Phoenix now, so I probably won't be far. But I want to go to this nail shop that's out in Phoenix and just kind of look around and see what they have. And then possibly just spend four hours and doing my own nails. So we'll see how that works out. Girl, set the stage because somebody's getting paid and free big slime out the cage. And Shreddy tried to play it cool, but now she wish she would have stayed because every song that I made is ringing like I got engaged. I love my guys I wouldn't trade. Ay, run the cradle to the... Yeah, I did not like that sausage and whatever it was. It was so I told him to take it back and now I'm waiting on the French toast to come out. What's that? Oh, blueberry. Yeah. I feel so bad. I hate telling people to turn take back food. Like I be feeling so bad. Even her mood changed when I told her to take the food back. I was like, she was like, oh. I was like, I do not like this. I'm so sorry. She was like, let me get a manager. I be feeling 
so it's so bad. That's why I'm like take the food back. I'd rather just suck it up and eat it. But they had music playing and now they're getting ready to go. So I was like, okay, let me turn on the camera. But it's still loud as fuck in here. Like, it's loud. Anyway, I just wanted to give y'all that update. I'm thinking about they have espresso martini. So I think I'm about to order espresso martini. My, um, I feel good now. Like, I don't even feel intoxicated or anything. Like, it went away. I mean, I ain't talking my assistant when I say niggas down to pack some. I'm not in the season of complaining. I promise. Y'all know I always complain. But I feel like I've been complaining a lot lately. And that's not the season we in. But that was not that was not it. I would not ever go back there. What you think, baby? It wasn't worth no $75. No. Yeah, that definitely was not worth $75. I feel like we're in a time where everybody is so focused on aesthetics and making everything look cute, mm -hmm. which is fine. Because that's why I came there. I literally came for the aesthetics. I saw it on TikTok. I follow this girl who goes to like a bunch of different places in Arizona and try different foods. And she goes to all the aesthetic places. But I still want my shit to taste good. It was not good at all. And then for them to not, and then for them to have a nonchalant attitude about my chocolate espresso martini. You could have told me that y'all didn't have the glasses. She was just like, oh. We don't have it. Okay, well, y'all should have told me that because I wouldn't have wanted that espresso martini if it came in a champagne glass. I'm upset. I don't had two different meals and I'm still hungry because I ate absolutely nothing. Anyway, we better go to this nail shop that's in Phoenix. Y'all just heard me complain for three minutes, so. Um, I'm anxious at this nail salon. They got the little hands so I can practice on. But I'm like, I want something that you can like, you know, like, I get what I'm trying to say? Probably not. But they got these, the little clips. I think those, I think you put them on top. Oh, but that don't work. Is she working? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she working. She was going down the And then they also got I wonder, oh, I think these, no, that don't make sense. This, go so with this, no. I don't know. I, I feel like these are practice too. Like you can practice on these, I'm gonna ask. And then, I'm trying to be like a real professional over here. This is what I need. $35. I need this. It's the hand. It's the handset. And then you attach it. Oh, I forget we don't got no light. Okay. Made it home. I'm glad I didn't get some of the stuff. But I did get one of these little powder things so I can put my powder because I, I did have all my nail stuff in like these. I don't remember why I got these for. Her. It was something for the business, but I was like, oh, this could work for my nail stuff. So I got this powder. Oh, it was something else I really wish I could have bought too. Well, I bought this so I can dip the brush in. So powder brush. And then I got another brush cleaner, but I already had some, so I didn't really need that. And then I got these sanding bits. This one's a sanding one. It's for fine. I really don't know what I'm doing, y'all. But y'all know, I just be buying stuff. That's how y'all know I'm just the queen of wasting money. I really am the queen of wasting money because I already have those. Look, I already got them. I already had them, but then I got the actual coarse ones. These are all like my nails. I'm thinking about doing these or maybe just a clear. I don't know. So we'll see. This is my actual powder. 
I actually need a little bit more of this. I should have bought more powder. And then this is my liquid. Y'all, I cannot believe. Oh, I did have these. See, that's what I was looking for. These. But I, so I bought this, but I already had this. This is what I was looking for when I was there, which they didn't have any in stock. I have the professional drill that they use when you go to the nail salon. This cost me like a hundred dollars, and I probably used it once. Um, Hobby Lobby as well. I wanted some rhinestones, so they had these little rhinestones here and then they had these pearl ones that I wanted these pearl flatbeds so different um, sizes of the pearl Touch. <laughs> and then I just thought these were so cute like I want something cute and like summer-ish and like chunky beach vibes on my nose Probably won't be today because I ain't there yet, but I just thought that would be cute for the future. So, yeah, we are. <laughs> All right, y'all. <clears throat> Let's see what we can do. Okay, y'all. So this is what the nails is kind of looking like so far. I'm not feeling this one with the rhinestone I just don't like it it's just something about it I don't like but I literally just did press-ons and just put the acrylic on there so I kind of like that but I don't know if you watch Peyton but she did something where she put like a chain on her nails so I kind of like that on my nails I think that would be so cute so I kind of want to like cut this and put this chain on here so I'm about to take this nail off and do it over and we're gonna add the chain so I'll be back with my new new design my sexy love say you love me say you love me but you never left for me yeah Ooh, all we do is make up and break up the only I could burn food that's pretty that's cooked for you already like how you burn macaroni when it's already cooked but anyway this is the dinner salmon grains panera macaroni these are the nails i took it off i think simple is better we're gonna go ahead and just leave it like that see you later